if I can have everybody step back here, I'll give a brief orientation and we'll get this show on the road here. Hi everyone, Mike Carey with Northwest Fishing Reports and Rob Holman, Northwest Fishing Reports. We're here today with Pat Shank of Seabreeze Charters. We are on the Four Seasons and Pat, our target species today is? It's going to be coho and Chinook salmon. Uh, yesterday actually we caught a steelhead out here, a beautiful steelhead. Wow. And, and first one this year, we catch them occasionally every year it seems like, but uh, mostly uh, coho. We're going to be uh, fishing kind of close to shore there, so we'll have a good chance to get a few kings too. Pat, this is a little bit of a family business, isn't it? Yes, I started in 1955 with my dad. I started back for him when I was eight. Fished with him for, for uh, or actually ten. I, I fished with him for eight years, and then I went and got my license when I was 18. Been doing it ever since. I retired from teaching here. I taught 30 years at the school district in Oahu. And uh, so now I just down to one full time job. Right? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, we've been doing it a lot of years. Great. All right, let's go. Let's go. All right, let's go fish and have a great time, everybody. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Looking forward to it. Good morning. Take us where the fish are. That's easy. They're between the surface and the bottom. <laughs> okay. <laughs> going through the gill, then behind the gill. I just go through the gill once. Okay. But that'll work too. Well, it does work. And then I'm bending them with the bend. I bend them. That's how it was being on the side of the camp. Like, oh, I don't want to bend them much. I'm like, all right, whatever. That's what I've been doing. Talk about your military service, and boom, you catch a fish. Like that. Yep. I'm gonna go front. Yeah. 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 
got over here that's uh that's long beach that's the city of long beach sea view is is a little bit further south inland we're only about 47 feet of water here okay and uh kind of a new spot for us you know today just trying it out sure and it seems to be working pretty good yeah we're having yeah. some luck so far yeah it's like the other boats there they're not doing so good offshore so this is the right choice today oh great uh so i noticed we're not very deep we're not, we're not, we're motor mooching, right? Yeah, right. But but fish have shallow lines. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know, fish tend to, when they're feeding, they tend to bring the bait up. So they're on the surface. You know, you'll catch a lot of fish right up on top. Not yeah. barking much down in my, my uh, scope down low anyway. Most of the sign has been up on top here. So that's why we're doing that. And it seems to be working. Yeah, it's been pretty good. <laughs> well, let's get back to it. Okay. Good luck, guys. Thanks. Uh -huh. Someone, double, double, double. Someone. Go ahead. There you go. That was gone. Woo! Turn the fish. Oh, yeah? Keeper! Got him. Stroke that baby up. We've been calling out keepers and not keepers, so explain what that means. Well, the, uh, the, the hatchery fish that we can keep have what would be a fin right here. It's called the adipose fin. It's a little teardrop shaped fin. And the lack of a fin makes it makes us all happy because that way we can keep this. If, if it had a fin here, we would have to throw it back in. So keeper. Keeper salmon. Hot dog. Yeah. No. Is it a big fish, Rob? Yeah. It's a, <laughs> I think it's a little bigger than the first one. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. That's a keeper. Oh, hey, you got it. Nice. King. That's Woo! What did you say about the king? Woo! Il Waco! <laughs> Josh did a great job feeding them line, set the hook, handed the rod over. We got us a real bright king in the boat. Good work on both parts. Yeah, appreciate it, man. Yeah, no problem. So you're using whole herring? Whole anchovy. Whole anchovy. Thank God, though, using one hook, it's uh, easier to clear the nets and get the daily fish off the line without hurting them. Mm -hmm. 
secret is, they need to spin in the water. If they're not spinning, you're not fishing. <laughs> it's gotta spin. Hey, you gotta spin. You gotta spin. Oh shit! Hook up! Hook up! There you go, work it to the back of the boat. Get that rod out of the holder. Spit, don't smile. What do you use both feet for? Come on, one Holy foot. Dog. You're a karate kid that. They point you right back over that side. Come on. Holy shit. Yeah. <laughs> 
He looks like he's having too much fun. <laughs> That's funny. That's not a loser. Oh, come on, fish. Woohoo! <laughs> Okay, folks, this is why you take a charter. Sea Breeze Charters out of Ilwaco. Look at that king. Oops, sorry, brother. Beautiful hatchery. That's got to be in the 20 pound range, eh? Right there, yeah. Yep. Uh, there you go. Geez. Go get them. Yeah, it's a nice king. Having a good time there, Ron? Yep. Oh. 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 That's the fish. That's the fish to end the day with. Oh man. <laughs> sea breeze charters, hat shank. Thank yeah. you for a great day on the water. Oh, yeah. You are welcome. Whoa. <laughs> All right. Hello. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> 